I'm Stephen from Naked Off Road and today I want to talk about emergency exits. Not your home, not your work, but these things, your four wheel drive. All right, so let's get into emergency exits, how you get out of a bad situation. All right, let's have a look. All righty, so here we are in the four wheel drive. Now, should something bad happen and I was, say, I don't know, in a river or someplace I shouldn't be and I needed to get out of the car for whatever reason. All right, the door's not going to open, there's a problem with the door, what do I do? Right, well, the only other exit is the window. So, all right, so this is a problem, the window, all right? Yep, Charlie has manual windows, but the problem with manual windows in a Series 3 is that they only take up half the glass, or they make up half the glass, so that still creates an issue. If you've got a really modern four-wheel drive, like, I don't know, in the 90s, you might have electric windows which may not work underwater or they may have a mechanical fault as well, so you need to get out of a car. How are we going to achieve this? It's pretty damn obvious. We need to break these. So, well, we all know they're not going to break so easy. So, what we need to do is find out a way of doing it. Alright, so let's take a look at what we can do. Okay, so clearly we need a solution. We need something that's going to aid us in this emergency situation and here it is it's this device here all right now I haven't used this device yet I'm going to test it out however the funny thing was I realized that in preparing for this video that I'm making now I write notes right I'm not that clever so I need to write some notes so here we are here's some notes that I wrote now the funny thing was is as I was writing the notes I realized I was using the tactical pen I picked it up by mistake. So here I am writing, and it's actually a really good pen. So, I mean, it's nice to have a facility on one end that, that may be of use for us, which we're going to have a look at, but hey, it's a pen. So this thing is actually can sit in your pocket or on your sun visor in your car, and it does actually have that secondary use, which is actually really important, because so many things have a single use. Well, that secondary use is just a bit crap, but actually, as far as I'm concerned, the pen worked really, really well. I mean, I write like crap, so you won't be able to understand it, but it does write very nicely, and that's actually quite important. So it did that job quite nicely. Now, we don't know whether it's any good in the window side of it, the point, the breaking of the window, the tungsten tip. Apparently, it's a tungsten tip. It's very, very strong. Take a look at the website. So here is their website right here. So these guys have... They, they say a lot about it. They talk it up. Let's see if it's any good, all right? Now, I'm not going to test it out on Charlie, but we have another car here prepared, and it's going to go to the scrap. So, basically, we're going to take a look at, at this little car, see what we can do. All right, let's have a look. Okay, so behind me here, you can see a little bright red car. It's actually Holden Cruise. I don't know what year it is, but anyway, it's going to the tip. The motor's seized up in it, so we have full use of the vehicle. Right, so we're going to take our little tactical pen, and we know that one end does the job, so let's see if the tungsten tip, the window breaking part, will do the job, all right? So let's have a test of this window. Now, I don't really actually want to test it from this side because that's sort of, you know, so I thought I'll get inside the car. Let's simulate what it's actually going to be like and whether this situation is going to work, all right? This car actually has electric windows and it doesn't have a battery, so if this car actually went underwater right now, I wouldn't be able to get out of it if the doors didn't open. All right, so let's get in this car and actually give it a test and see what this thing does any does any good. All right, guys. So here we are. We're inside the car now. As you can tell, I've got some paper overalls on and I've got some goggles on. As much as I like to um, be as real as I can with a, a test such as this, I don't actually want to cut myself or damage my eyes in this situation. If I was in an emergency situation. Yes, I would close my eyes and I'd smash the window because my life is threatened. Right at the moment, I'm testing this out. So what we're going to do is we're going to test this out now. We're going to test it out real, we're going to test it out properly. So here we are, we're inside the car and just imagine that at the moment this car is going underwater. Now as you can tell, electric windows aren't working. You know, right? Imagine that the door won't open. Can't get it out. Can't get out the window. No matter what I do, that's not going to go. So let's give a go with this. So hold it in one hand, you know, middle of the glass, and let's see what we can do. Right. We're out. Right. 
there we go. Out of the car. Matter of seconds. I would not have got out of this car if I didn't have that pen in my hand. So the tactical pen, does it work? Well, it worked to right and it just smashed that window. As you can tell, there was no way that I was going to smash that glass by myself. If I was banging on it, I'd be banging on that until I broke my hand. Yet this thing, one bang, one hit, one smash, out. In fact, the glass is still here tingling away. And this car's actually got tinted windows as well. So that's why it took some pushing to get that glass out because it had a plastic film on it. Does the pen work? It works. All right, guys, so this pen, I can take my glasses off now. That pen, this pen is available from Archer Accessories, and I'll put their website up on here. Um, I would recommend for $25 that you get one of these, keep it on your sun visor, keep it in your car. This is a very, very worthwhile device for peace of mind inside your car. You can see how easy I got out that glass window. That's what you need to do. All right, over and out.